I'm about to go turn this fan on so I can feel like Beyonce in this bitch. Hermes Link. <laughs> Ice Blue Mink. Tat on my ribs like I do not know what permanent is. They want me gone. Wait for the kicker. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jay Da Vinci. As some of you guys know, if you aren't already subscribed, subscribe to my channel. You watching you, yes, you right now. You click this video because you were looking for an affordable wig. In the future, I promise you, you're gonna find a lot more affordable wigs on my channel. When I was scrolling on a lot of hair bloggers, and this is no shade, but when I was scrolling on their comments, a lot of the girls were saying how they couldn't afford the wigs. And it's, it's normal, you know? It's normal to not be able to afford a thousand or a seven hundred dollar wig, come on. Whose budget is that in? So this is what I'm trying to say. I want to help women or men who are looking for the cheap sleigh. I'm going to also be having super affordable, nice quality wigs, along with dummy expensive wigs. You might be the person who has the budget of $700 for the wig, you know? Or you might be the budget, the person who has that $200 budget, but needs a good wig that's going to last. You feel me? So the unit that I'm currently wearing is from Sensational. I have a few other hair videos from Sensational, so I do like their wigs. This wig style, Ina, I-N-N-A, and it's in the color DR27. It's a super pretty, like, coppery, you know, what else? Tiana Taylor, eh, you know? Like, it's super cute. This wig doesn't come with any combs, so if, you know, you, you got short hair and you really need your hair to... <laughs> There is no combs. I don't feel like this wig is gonna fall off my head. I've literally been wearing this wig all day. I just took my engagement photos and I had this wig on, it was so cute. I did slick down my edges. I normally don't do that, but I was like, what if the, the wind blows back? I at least need my edges slicked down. So I slicked down my edges. I also, you know, I tweezed it a little, but I get so frustrated when it comes to like tweezing and plucking lace. I feel like I'm gonna break it. I, I'm just not the professional when it comes to customizing hairlines yet, but I am so down to teach myself and that's what I'm doing now. But yeah, so I just tweezed it a little and then I went in with my concealer, like a creamy concealer, and I literally enhanced my part. Oh, the last thing that I did was I took some baby powder and um, I just, you know, put it all through the hair. Because I know, y'all know, sometimes the wigs in the sunlight, they be looking like starch. The powder was supposed to help make it look a bit more natural and I think it did. So I really, really, really love it. This is definitely not a wig to sleep in. I'm gonna advise you now, take it off at nighttime. This is a synthetic wig and it's long as hell. So you're going to experience some tangling in the back in the future. I can always cut it and it's gonna be perfect. But yeah, I'm not tripping about that because this wig was of course under $30. This is what the side looks like, definitely not natural. Um, in case you were wondering. I would not, uh-uh. Just, just wear it down, don't be difficult. You could probably pull it over to the side, but I really like it in the middle. So yeah, I hope you guys like these affordable wig reviews. I'm gonna be doing a whole lot more. You can drop a wig that you want me to review, and if I think it's cute, I might review it. <laughs> oh, I haven't been experiencing any like shedding or anything like that. So uh, yeah, that's definitely. But yeah, I'm gonna be having a giveaway coming up soon, so stay tuned for that. Don't forget to give this video a big old thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Let's have some fun. Good.